Wife drives the golf cart. She hates the backing up noise when you put the golf cart in reverse. Um, so to disconnect that buzzer, it's actually really easy. You need to remove the two main screws here, and then there's gonna be a screw up there. You're gonna to need to use Allen wrenches to remove that. You're gonna pull this down. And then the buzzer is actually mounted right here. So what I just did, I just removed the positive connector which feeds the power to the buzzer to go off when it's in reverse mode. So I just simply just disconnected that and now there's no buzzer. Now I know some of you might say that's a safety issue, but if you're just using a golf cart to just ride around and it's you know your own piece of land, you're not really worried about that stupid buzzer going off all the time when you're in reverse. So like I said, it's a simple way just to uh, disconnect. And if you ever 